Well, how do their chums? Tis I, Captain of the Steves, back with a cup of tea with Captain Steve episode. Feels like a long time since I've done one of these, but I've been sent some footage, people. Some footage from over in the US of A got emailed to me because they know that I like the strange and bizarre. And they know that I've covered off the Loch Ness and also the Loch Ness monster sightings. They've spotted something similar in Lake Champ, or have they? Let's jump on over to that footage and let's take a look at it, shall we, people? Because it's quite riveting. So we go. So here be that footage. Now I'm just going to play it at normal st speed, first of all. But where you're looking is down here. You see that sort of grey mass right there? I mean, it's a small rowboat, but you no, know, it's still the length of a person. But let's hit play. Kaboom. And I think you can see what I can see just under the surface of the water there, people. It's a very interesting silhouette, isn't it? Well, you know what? I think we need to watch that again and slow it down. So here we go, people. Slow mercy on. So yeah, it's down here in this corner here. Now, what I will probably try and do is put this into my editor and zoom this right in. But I can clearly see a dorsal fin and I can see two side fins on this creature. Its head looks quite rounded. And you can kind of see the back sort of fin almost moving slightly there. I think this might be some form of shark, perhaps. Or maybe even, I don't know, maybe a sturgeon of some kind. It doesn't have the long neck. It doesn't look like some sort of plesiosaur. It doesn't look as prehistoric as what um, I feel the Loch Ness Monster is. It, it feels too, I don't know, shark-like. Just there. I mean, it could be some form of whale, perhaps, but it definitely has that sort of makeup. It looks more fish-like to me than dinosaur-like to me. But nonetheless, it's still a large freaking creature that's inside of Lake Champ. If somebody hooked that and pulled that ashore, I think that would hit headlines. It's not, It's something to boast about, definitely. It's something that's out of place, and it's, it's the size of this whole rowboat. And it's, he's only metres from it, you know? That's a brown trouser moment waiting to happen right there, I think, people. But for them to capture this on drone footage is pretty darn freaking awesome. So chums, what I've done is I've actually paused, zoomed in, gone into Photoshop, changed all the hues, brightness, things like that. And here's some of the cleaned up images that I have of this creature inside of this lake. Now, you know, I'm no creature expert. I'm no zoologist, no cryptozoologist. I'm just an interested party, just like any of you. So what I would say to you, has this person managed to capture the lake monster of Lake Champ? Is this something out of place? Could this be a prehistoric entity? Could this be something for cryptozoology experts to take a look at? Let us know in the comments, sound on off. And please read the video description to find out where this come from. This is from an organization that has done some awesome sort of books and movies on Lake Champ and the sea monster. It kind of borders on fictional, I believe, with drawers of, um, you know, sightings, things like that. I haven't done a deep dive myself, but there's all the info inside the video description. Hit them up and thank you very much, the people that sent me this. Much appreciated. Heck yes, I'll put your email, I'll censor out anything that I need to, just to show where it came from in a roundabout way. But thank you very much for sending me this your way, uh, this my way. If you, out there in the viewerverse, are sitting on some really strange footage that you want me to do a cup of tea with Captain Steve episode on and give my opinions and deep dive and analysis, send it over. Whether that be UFOs, cryptids, ghosties, anything. Anything of the strange and bizarre and odd, you know, send it over. I'd gladly take a look. Anyway, till next time, people. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again. Now have my tea now. Yes, you can get this merch mug on my merch store. And I have my own brew of tea, if you didn't already know. Until next time, goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again.